RT's Spanish channel spoke to him shortly afterwards, and here's what he said. I want to remind you all that when Obama was elected president, he said that his aim was to end all wars. But during the time of his presidency, the number of wars only increased. Look at Libya, for instance. The U.S. organized an outrageous military intervention that was followed by the killing of the country's president. And after that, Libya's oil wells have fallen under their control. They finance rebels that fight against the rulers that don't support imperialism and capitalism. On top of that, they run a worldwide surveillance network. We need to establish a court where world powers and international human rights organizations take the role of judges. We need to file a collective lawsuit aimed at putting an end to this genocide. I think that the threat exists for any country with vast natural energy resources, especially oil and gas. I understand that this is a direct threat to Venezuela. In order to secure energy resources for his own country, Obama will invade any other country. But he's not the leader of the world.